It's officially launch day for Madden 23, and EA dropped headliners in the game, new ones at least, in their limited time. It's Demarcus Lawrence and 89 overall Jalen Hurts. Both these cards look pretty good overall-wise, but let's go check out some of the stats real quick. <laughs> Besides this Jalen Hurts and Demarcus Lawrence, it doesn't look like there was any other content that dropped today. I know there's a few issues that EA is working on in the back end with like rookie premiere tokens and everything. So hopefully they're using this time to get everything fixed. And it also looks like that prices are... <laughs> About where to be expected right now. Limited time to Marcus Lawrence going for 393,000 coins right now. Damn near 400K. But let's look at the stats. Is it truly worth it? 81 speed, 85 acceleration, 84 strength, 89 tackling, 87 play rec, 88 block shit, 81 power move, and 87 finesse move are the main stats to look at. It also looks like Demarcus Lawrence comes equipped with no outsiders, quicker run sheds against outside zone plays, and unstoppable force pass rush wins lead to quicker block shedding so demarcus lawrence looks like a beast would i pick him up for 400k right now i'm working with a limited budget as you see so the way my coins are set up and then jalen hurts is going for 458,000 coins jeez there's so many damn coins right now jalen hurts let's look at the stats 85 speed 88 throw power 88 short accuracy 87 medium 87 deep, 87 throw under pressure, 87 throw on the run, and 82 play action are the main stats that we need to look at right here. And then his equipables. He has quick draw, which is faster throwing animations when under pressure, and escape artist, improved scrambling speed when leaving the pocket. So I think this is one of the first quarterbacks that get escape artist automatically on their card. I don't know any others. We have 4,200 points and 500,000 coins. I'm not using those coins, so get it out of your sick twisted head but we have 4200 points and we also have our weekly elite fantasy pack and the pro elite fantasy pack for this week available plus our daily gold and then whatever remaining points that we have left over i'm more than likely going to buy a headliners pack or something along those lines just to give you all a little mini pack opening for these limiteds first things first daily gold plus player let's get it out of the way let's see if we can get an elite out of here i've already gotten one elite once so far this week and we get a 73 overall. Looks like today's not going to be our lucky day. Now we go for the weekly elite fancy pack. Um, you know, I'm expecting at least an 82 overall in the pack. You know, hopefully we can get something that's worth a lot of coins. 83 overall, Rob Haverstein. Okay. Starting out with an 83. Devon got... I'm not going to pronounce that last name, so don't even think about it. And last but not least, our coin quick sell card is going to be Khalil Mack, 85 overall. Okay. All right. Well, um, that worked out better than I was expecting. Not going to lie. So next one up for the weekly Elite Fantasy Pack, our first card is going to be a Zach Martin, 87 overall Zach Martin. Let's freaking go. What is the next one going to be? We have This has to be the fire pack right here. Emmanuel, we don't want you. You're an 81. What is the last one? Please be an 88. Another 85 Khalil Mack. As much as I want to take Khalil again, I'm taking Zach Martin. That's, that's got to be the right play, right? Okay, after contacting my local Cowboys enthusiasts, we're going to take Zach Martin because apparently he's going for 120K right now. So welcome to the team, good old Zach Martin. You're going to be gone and sold for coins pretty soon. Now that we got that one out the way, we have our Pro Elite Fantasy Pack. This one gives us two guaranteed platinum players and we choose two of four elites in here the first elite is going to be a headliners and it's going to be 82 overall james connor not gonna lie i saw the animation i was really hoping for a limited right there second card is going to be the elite and it's going to be Dion dawkins 81 overall here come the platinum cards the first one up it's going to be justin lawler 81 overall the last one is going to be Lawrence Guy, 82 overall. So I'm going to go with James Conner so I can get a headliners elite player. And then I'm also going to go with Lawrence Guy. The reason I'm getting my headliners player in is possibly to complete the sets. You never know. But hey, at least we got another platinum card. That's a damn good amount of coins we've made so far. So looking at our newest cards, let's go ahead and quick sell Lawrence Guy and Khalil Mack. And we made 84,000 coins off that pack opening alone. I'm not, hey, 
I'm not mad, I'm okay with it, but right now I'm just debating what to use those 2200 points on. So guys, what we're gonna do is open up two Pro Elite packs. What I honestly was about to do was go ahead and use the last remaining 2200 points and get this man-to-man -man pack to boost up my defense, but quite honestly, eh, I think I'll be all right. I think I'll live. Right now, we want to pull for our limited time cards. We want to go for that big time pull. This is going to be the dumb decision here. The smart decision just to get your team up and running is one of these packs. I already went ahead and bought the run and gun pack during my stream, which I will actually be getting those clips up here, you know, sooner or later. Just got to stop being lazy and edit it. But I did get this run and gun pack that came with 86 overall Jamar Chase and 85 Kyle Pitts. Huge upgrade to the offense. They give you a lot of players to fill out your offensive line and your actual offense in itself. This one, though, with cornerback Xavier Howard and Denzel Ward, I've seen a lot of people running right now. And honestly, Denzel Ward, Xavier Howard have killed me have killed me going against them in head-to-head. -head. So that's the smart play. I'll probably still pick it up sooner or later. But we're going to go for the Pro Elite Fantasy or the Pro Elite Pack. I was going to say Fantasy Pack. It's just a Pro Elite Pack. For 1,050 points, we have enough to buy two right here. So let's see if we can get something good right off the rip. Brandon Zylstra, Z Zylstra, I think that's how you pronounce it, for the Panthers. Hey, we got a Carolina Panther. I'm happy already. Taco Charlton, best name in the NFL. Our next one, Kawan Williams. 77 overall uh, corner and Matt Ryan 80. We get a washed up quarterback. I mean, we get a washed up NFC South, former NFC South uh, quarterback. So there's that. Lastly, in the pack, it's going to be T. Higgins, 82 overall wide receiver for the Cincinnati Bengals. Is he good? And our last Pro Elite pack for this video. Hopefully EA drops something dope over this weekend in terms of content. That way, you know, we kick off the Madden season off right. You know, let's put out Legends, all that fun stuff. Our first two cards, nothing spectacular. Our first Elite in this pack, it's going to be Tremaine Edmonds, 81 overall middle linebacker. Second Elite back to back, Lawrence Guy, 82 overall. Another gold and another goal to finish it off hayden hurst oh that's that's not the best kind of pack for ten dollars not gonna lie do so you know what i'm gonna do i think i can buy about four of these headliner packs before i could just say screw it you know we'll go through about 100k worth of these packs and we'll call it a session headliners packs let's see if we can get that limited time pull first one up hey mikel walker 82 overall middle linebacker that's good i need those elites for headliners to fill out those sets the next one 78 overall Kadarius tony do these things come guaranteed with two yeah, so it comes with a 78 and a 74 overall uh, or better player. Okay, so you get two guaranteed in here. The, the odds are pretty good. We should have opened up these packs low key. For the, yo, honestly, should have opened up these packs. Now that I think about it, headliner player right there, 82 overall, Caleb Farley. Nice. Next one is going to be Randell Moore. And it's just a gold 2-2 two, two at well. All right, I've got two more left in me, and then we can call it a pack opening. Can we pull a limited time card? Are we able to do that? Do we have it in us in this video to pull the limited time? 82 overall, John Ruyan. Nice. Okay, cool. Next headliner. Do we have it in us? We don't have it in us right now. One more. One more. I want to give it an honest shake here. I want to try and actually do it. Justin Evans. No, not you. Headliners player. Is it a limited? No. Elijah Moore, 82 overall. A gold. An elite. Okay, that's not our other one. A84 Shaquille Barrett. So I know I said that that was going to be my last pack, but... No, I think we can, with that Shaquille Bear pull, I think we can pull this one out. We have 481,000 coins. I'll go down to about 400K. Right when I get to that 400K mark, that's when I'm going to call it, you know, I'm calling it the pack opening. No more. That's when we're going to call it. Can we get a limited card? Headliner player, 79 overall. Joe something from the Buccaneers. Another headliner, Julian Aquara from the Lions. Not who I want and no elites. I know we can pull a limited time player. We're going to do it this year. That is the goal is pulling a limited time player before the end of the year. I don't want to get to like golden ticket season and that's our only limited pull. And our first headliners is not going to be the limited. This is not going to be anything good at 79 overall Trey Lance, but I'm okay with it. And that's going to be Christian Fulton. Damn. This right here is going to put us right under 400,000 coins. So this is going to be the final pack. Our first card is going to be 82 overall Caleb Farley. Gold, gold, not an elite. And then our headliner player, and that is going to be Eric Stokes. So not what we really wanted, but 
but we did get some good elites out of there so if you guys pulled any packs today let me know in the comment section down below if you got any of the limiteds or if you got anything good out of it hopefully ea drops us legends this weekend so we can get a nice start to the whole entire like madden season i want to see everybody pull something great this year pull some limiteds for me damn it if we're gonna pull packs i mean but you know don't do that either way i will see you guys in the next video take it easy y'all have a safe one peace guys